people are dead. Cleveland police got a 911 call and found the victims in a home on the city's west side. News Channel 5 Stephanie Ramirez continues our coverage now from the Cleveland Police Department. And Steph, what did people on the scene today tell you? Well, Tracy, right now we're outside of the first district on Cleveland's west side. That's who's handling this investigation. And out on the street where this happened, the neighbors are stunned. Early Sunday afternoon, police blocked at the 3400 block of West 125th Street as investigators removed evidence from this west side home. Family members of the victims watching helplessly. Cleveland police are investigating a possible murder-suicide at this address that involved two victims. Neighbors tell us were a couple. It was really shocking. Like, I never knew anything was wrong down there. Christina Kaiser tells us the family moved into this home right after Kaiser and her family moved out. The two staying in touch through their kids. My kid, uh, she was always down there playing with the little girl. They were respectful. The kids were even well-mannered. The man involved is just 24 years old, according to the Cuyahoga County Coroner's Office. Police are still investigating how the murder-suicide unfolded. Neighbors watching can only offer their condolences. I heard the mother crying and stuff. I think this was this girl mother. She was crying about her daughter. And um, it was pretty sad, so I hope everything to be all right. And the medical examiner identified the 24-year-old male as Peter Ogletree Jr. They haven't released information on the female victim yet. We're live on the West Side, Stephanie Ramirez, News Channel 5.